My favorite thing to do is to respond when people are like, you'll never be a woman. I'll be like, and you'll never be a man. Gentlemen, let's say you're having trouble getting it up and you wanna buy something to fix that problem. Yo, before we get deep into this video, I wanna give a huge shout out to Too Lazy To Try. This channel, first of all, is amazing. Go check it out, go subscribe, go support. And uh, this video would not be possible without him. Please don't sue me, but I just saw the video. I enjoyed the video, and I wanted to talk about the clips that he showcased in that video because it relates back to the George video I dropped a few days ago. Now, if you guys are not aware of who Bobby Lee is, he is a comedian, he's a freak in the sheets and that's kind of like the main crux of what we'll be getting into bobby lee has a history throughout his career of being a type of comedy pervert you could say i mean i'm also a comedy pervert i think about like 100 percent of my jokes consist of some sort of genitalia as like the punchline. but the difference between me and bobby is that i'm doing it on a youtube video and bobby is irl kissing people uh touching their bulges and their pants and saying that sounds so crazy, it sounds hyperbolic, but this is absolutely real. And this guy is an extremely famous comedian. I'm pretty sure he's in like the top 5% of comedians. I mean, he gets a lot of coverage online. He's on a huge podcast called Bad Friends with fellow comedian Andrew Santino. I mean, this guy is he's the complete package of an online famous guy, comedian, IRL famous guy. He's a popular guy. And he touches bulges and ball sacks and shit. What the fuck? For a quick little recap on the George situation, like if you heard me say George earlier and you have no idea who I'm talking about, we're talking about George Bambino, George Jamha, and we're also talking about um, Mike Malak, I think. Oh wait, sorry, Bobby Lee. That's the title. So like a year or two ago now, Bobby Lee was on the Impulsive podcast with George Soros and George was getting molested. Sorry, dude, I can't say that. I mean, he was technically getting. What is going on? What's so crazy to me is that Bobby Lee is on a podcast and I've never even watched this podcast in full besides seeing a couple of clips online throughout the year multiple years maybe not sure how long it's been going on but i've seen a few clips of the podcast i mean it seems all right two comedians uh making jokes and stuff i mean bobby lee touches people the question of the hour the question of the entire career of bobby lee is like how have people not ridden up a storm how people have not sparked outrage over this it's kind of insane to me bobby lee has a really devoted fan base and a lot of his fans will call you a pussy if you disagree over the fact of Bobby Lee touching people's crotches and ball sacks is actually funny. If you think, oh, that's not really that funny. People will call for your internet beheading and they will say that you're being a sensitive prick. Now, I totally disagree with this and I think it's completely fine for George Janko not to want to be uh, I mean, just dabbled and diddled right in front of uh, all of his friends on the podcast with no one saying anything besides some people chuckling in the background. Oh my god, Bobby Lee is so crazy. He's touching George's cock right now. Wow. It was funny when he did this in 2008 too, and he's doing it in- But anyways, this is the portion of the video now where I wanted to react and do the whole monkey dance, monkey dance. Don't take that the wrong way. Also, 23.9%, don't be mad. And just before we get started, I want to once again reiterate that this video would not be possible without Too Lazy to Try's video. Go check that out, and uh, yeah, I hope he's chill with me, like, kind of using his clips. I mean, I feel like every other YouTuber does this, but I mean, again, dude, like, I don't know, it was like, a good video, and I- I just wanted to make a video on it because like some of the shit was like so crazy that I saw that shit and I was like, dude, I gotta make a video on this. By the way, are you watching this video? By the way, are you listening to me? Do you hear me? Let's get coffee. Muscle, that's one muscle. It's very soft, fucker. Touch it, touch it, come here, come here, come here, touch it. Right here, okay. <laughs> I trick you. <laughs> I sneak. So yeah, so Bobby in this clip totally just grazed his hand over this man's cock. And clearly, I mean, it's already been said a million times, but not a lot of dudes who don't like penises are gonna be cool with that. This man seems pretty flustered. Look at his face, look at his face, pretty sad, pretty upset. And uh, Bobby Lee, the fact that this is like his punchline is absolutely crazy. Like Bobby Lee's punchline is assaulting people in sexual ways. That is crazy, and all his fans think, once again, if you don't find it funny, you're sensitive and you're a pussy. 
Meanwhile, Bobby can stick his entire hand up other Bobby's vagina on camera, Bobby Altoff, and it's completely fine. Even though she's yelling for help, it's completely fine. By the way, uh, these are just jokes and stuff, and it's like, uh, don't sue me, and it's like uh, in Minecraft, like he, GTA roleplay, and the clips are just artificial intelligence YouTube, so like. Get that on TV, I'm so Bobby, sorry. let's talk about your hair. Can we talk about, <laughs> what is it with the Addison Improv guys with the Courtney? The comedians at Addison Improv, I don't they know love what you. it is. No, you're being. <laughs> you <know. laughs> oh, oh. It's like in the A neck. little sneak attack, you know? Ask me, please. Are there, Can I touch your legs? Because they're so nice. Are there, don't touch um, mine. Are there comedians? <laughs> <laughs> wow, bumpy. <laughs> Real bumpy. I didn't shave yeah. because I didn't wow. know I wanted to keep you off. You're on television, please. <laughs> no, one is, no one can see if I shaved or didn't shave. I know. That far away. I know. Don't, don't be mad at me. I try to ask real questions, and this is what happens all the time. <laughs> you can see Bobby Lee. I'm at the Addison weekend, Improv Addison all weekend. Improv. Dude, if this guy was like a 39 year old Minecraft YouTuber with five kids and shit doing this live on like a, a fucking Twitch stream or some shit to like Pokemon. So many people would clip it on Twitter and be like, this guy is a fucking freak. This guy is unsoliciting, soliciting people to be kissed by his lips to their mouth pieces on their cheekbone. Very weird, very fucked up, very sexual. Lots to talk about here, lots to talk about here. Lots of breakdown about this clip. Why is this bimbo sitting there just taking it in? Like, you know, you have to push him off and tell him no. Everyone's scared of Bobby because he's like the P. Diddy of the comedy scene. Come on, good to see you. Because you were on paternity leave last night, right? It's good to see you. I love it. I lived in Europe for a while. That's how we can. That is how you can. That's how we can. Did he lick you? Fine. I don't have the bird flu. Do it again? What am I going? What? 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 Where are you going? Do not kiss my ankle. My ankle bone. I'm sorry. Come back. Everything's fine. Everything's fine, everybody. Everything's fine. Come back. I want to assault you anymore. No, I don't trust you. Why? Because I can see you <laughs> jumping a mile on away, me and I and see you too. <laughs> I see you too. I was, we have dogs. You have a dog. I have a dog. <laughs> you, Come here right now. You're being so I rude right now. You're being so rude right now. Come back to the seat. Come back to the seat. Come back to the seat. You're being so rude right now. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. I apologize. My bad. I'm sorry. If you get up again, I swear to God, I'm never gonna come back here. Okay. Anyway, um, I have three cats and a dog, and um, God, those ankles are so appetizing. <laughs> oh my God, that's got really. I just want to. <laughs> Look at this stupid retard falling down because he's so goddamn horny. This is the problem with modern civilization, the power of the internet, and the sexual content that people who are under certain religions post on the internet, dude. It leads Bobby Lee Altoff to falling out of his comedy chair sniffing and licking toes live on tv cable tv satellite and people find this guy funny bro and they say once again if you get touched on your dick and you don't like it you're sensitive the only thing sensitive is my fucking cock after it being touched okay um i wasn't actually touched by bobby uh, lee Be true that's true interesting i would love to see your feet thank you Jiminy Crickets. Jiminy Crickets, I fucked up. Why would you say that out loud? I was looking at her boots right now. I go, I like the boots, but I'm like, what's underneath it? And I go, probably nice feet. You're not saying that in a gross way, are you, bud? Not in a sexual, no. All right. I don't find her sexually attractive. How big are your feet? <laughs> Why? Do you get like a little limp between your toes? or? Will know. you save some and send it to him? No, it's just, this is weird. This is what you do to me. When I'm going to leave here and tell people you're so what? weird. You say Bobby was weird? That's so yeah. fucking, it's so crazy because it's like, why can't you ask these questions? Dude, Bobby Altoff has been in the industry for like nine months. She already got smashed by Drake, already got smashed by Ryan Garcia, some uh, NBA players who were all white. And now Bobby Lee is talking about licking those toes, sucking the toes, kissing the toes. What's up with the toe thing anyways, bro? Like, I can't find it so attractive. Never once saw a toe that I was like, oh man, like that toe, I'm horny, right? Bobby Lee, put him in an insane asylum, lock him away, put him in a cage. Um, also, Bobby Lee, if you saw this video and you're gonna like copyright claim it, like don't, don't do that. They really love me, it's my turn. You got a problem, I let that iron bust. I don't fuck with fake love, you can keep that lust. I don't got a drug problem, but I feel a rush. I am finally up, don't hit my line.